Workers at Denby Pottery in Derby were on strike today in a dispute over a pay freeze. The company says it can't afford to raise their wages this year. There will be another strike next Wednesday and further action at the company's Middleport pottery site the week after that. As Callum Watkinson reports, both sides are adamant they won't back down. One of the great survivors of the Midlands pottery industry, Denby has been turning out fine china for more than 100 years. David Ferns worked here for almost half that time. For him, today's strike is a low point. It's the worst day of my life. I never thought that we'd come to a point where the management and the workforce had got to the stage where we had to withdraw our labour. It's never happened before uh, and I hope it never happens again. But we've been pushed and pushed and pushed. No pay rise this seen two increases since 2010, but unions say they've been spread far too thinly. That actually covers a six-year span, and in that six-year span, 4.5% isn't very good over six years. The rates of pay on this company for our members are being driven down by stealth. So the rates of pay as they were six years ago are no comparison now. Two pay awards in six years, our members, quite frankly, have just had enough. They say the company can afford to be generous, citing a threefold increase in overseas sales. But the boss says workers are wrong to focus on those numbers. Financial results for 2012 are very clear. We had no sales growth last year and we saw our profits decline to a break-even position. Far East exports are moving forward, but our exports to the Far East are less than 5% um, of our total business and that can't carry the whole group. The company is very clear that its position um, uh, will, will not change as a consequence of the strike action. And the workers say they'll keep on striking until they get their raise. Callum Watkinson, ITV News, Derby.